Did you find out about the land when we did, or did you have an idea this story is about to break, and did you drop your head like, oh, my God, here we go again? <laughs> no, you know, I, I, I equated to, I, I knew about the purchase. You know, obviously we had gone through, you know, the, the commissioner had known. This wasn't designed to be a secret. It could yeah. have been kept a secret for much longer than 17 days from the, the final transaction. There's nothing to hide here, and I think right. that's that's one of the key takeaways from this. We're, we're being upfront. We confirm that, that Stan and his companies did buy the land, you know, obviously, I know that it sets off, you know, some level of worry amongst Both our fans. States, right. But but yeah. here's here's the truth. We did three season ticket holder luncheons the week before the Super Bowl. We did three in season ticket holder luncheons at the end of December. The first question in all of them was the stadium, right? So this isn't something that's far from people's minds. It's not like the the land purchase set off, you know, worries about this. We've always said, I was in here in December and January saying this is the hardest year to message as the team. It's the first time you're year to year. And I think that's the biggest worry of people. I remember the Chargers went year to year. People for team Chargers had training camp in Los Angeles for, for two years, yeah. and, you know, at the Home Depot Center and the world was ending that, that their team was moving and they're still in San Diego. I think there are lots and stops and starts to these things. I never uh, get downtrodden about trying to build our fan base. It's our job to build a winning product to put a winning product on the field, to improve the fan experience, and to make this a place that the people want to come and be a fan of. And sure, would it be easier if you know the stadium issue? A lot is easier. But I came here in 2009, yeah. and the first questions people asked in 2009 were about the stadium and right. the pending arbitration. This hasn't been far from people's mind, and I think that's the reason we need to come up with a solution that solves this once and for all, because I don't want this to be a topic five years down the road, ten years down the road. Kicking the can down the road doesn't help. We need to come up with a solution. And the, and the one very good positive I've taken away from the past few weeks is that people genuinely care. There are a lot of civic leaders who care, and there are more people who have popped out of the woodwork saying, you know, what can we do to help than have in the previous three years combined?